हेलो फ्रेंड्स गुड मॉर्निंग गुड आफ्टरनून गुड इवनिंग सो दिस इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वीडियो एंड गुड न्यूज फॉर सम स्टूडेंट्स हु वांट टू डू बेसिकली चेंज ऑफ कॉलेज आल्सो सो चेंज ऑफ कॉलेज एंड चेंज ऑफ ब्रांचेस आर ऑल परमिटेड फॉर द स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ द थर्ड एंड द फिफ्थ सेमेस्टर स्टार्टिंग ऑफ द सेकेंड ईयर और स्टार्टिंग ऑफ योर थर्ड ईयर ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग राइट एंड दिस इज द वी टी यू बेलगाम अपडेट्स ऑन यू नो सिमिलर नोटिफिकेशन विच दे सेंड टू कॉलेज एंड आई एम गोइंग टू कवर द वन फॉर दिस ईयर राइट सो दिस इज द नोटिफिकेशन विच केम ऑन नाइन्थ ऑफ डिसम्बर and it has came come from vtu vishwa technological university for the for the subject you can see invitation applications for change of college for the third and the fifth semester ug for the academic year 22 23 from the students of affiliated constituent and vtu departments colleges right so those students who are from the uh, vtu affiliated colleges and uh, all those can do this and this notification has gone to all the vice chancellors with the approvals and these are the important dates right so if you can see the commencement of uh, application on vtu web portal so you have to apply on the vtu portal for uh, this uh, you know college change or the branch change process by 9th of and uh, the commencement of process started from 9th of uh, december and the last date is 14th of december so similar dates will come when you are there in your third and the fifth uh, semester and you will have to keep track on this this events if you are interested now let's talk about first the fees part of it right so is there a new fees which you will have to pay if you want to do this change of college and the change of branch the answer is yes so if you see in the particulars change of college affiliated to affiliated college so if you just want to change the college that means you don't want to change the branch but you are looking to change the college then the fees applicable is 8000 rupees you have to pay one time right if for the change of college right and the second one is change of college with branch right so here also if you are changing your college and also you are changing your branch and you can move from affiliated to affiliated college that means the college which was anyway under vtu from that college you are moving moving to another college which is under vtu then you have to pay you know 15500 rupees that is the fees so hope you understood that first two line items are for moving from affiliated college to affiliated college one with the change of college and second one with the change of college and branch right now you see the third one that there is a difference between the first two and the third one the third one is the change of college that means you are not changing the branch you are just changing the college but from affiliated to autonomous so what does means that there are only you know 30 to 35 autonomous engineering colleges in whole of karnataka only 30 to 35 autonomous college across karnataka including 13 to 14 of them in bangalore itself right so if you are moving from any non autonomous college right which is a plain affiliated college it is non autonomous college moving from non autonomous college to any autonomous college like rv college of engineering bms college of engineering niti minakshi or bnmit or those type of autonomous college then the total fees applicable will be 15000 which is for the change of college with branch 8000 plus 7500 right to total 15500 you have to pay now the next category of students like fourth one is from migration from other universities right and vtu autonomous college to vtu non autonomous college right which is just affiliated college so this means that fourth one is applicable to student who are from other universities like dayanand sagar university or somebody is going into from from cmr university or from any other university which is reva university if you want to change from those universities which are not under vtu to any college which is under vtu right so if you want to do that and also you can move from autonomous college to non autonomous college i don't know why somebody will move from non uh, from autonomous college to non autonomous college but if you want to do from autonomous to non autonomous then these two type of students from university to uh, uvt affiliated or from autonomous to non autonomous then you have to pay 18000 extra so your fees will be then 18000 plus 7500 that is 25500 rupees you have to change 
you have to do for change of branch and college right if you are moving like so that is the fourth category and the fifth category is for the students who are moving from universities again like dadanan sagar university reva university cmr university presidency university to any vtu autonomous college like rvc bmsc and mit so those category student they will have to pay 20000 23000 that is 15500 plus 7500 total 23000 they have to pay so you hope you understand this five different type of migrations which is happening from uh, non autonomous college to autonomous college or non autonomous college to non autonomous college or any university to autonomous college and university to non autonomous college so these are different types and with change of branch and the with the change of college and one of the important thing that you should understand is that student must have cleared all subjects right up to say fifth semester or up to third semester you should have cleared all subject of the previous semester and students with backlogs will not be allowed so if you have any backlog or f grade or fail grade then you will not be eligible to pass through so you have to get a complete clearance from your existing college right that you have passed all the subjects then only you are applicable for the change of branch and the change of college which i just explained in the five different types of four different types of students so to apply to this process right this type of notification will come and then there will be a vtu portal which will be open for students to apply you know for this change of branch and change of college process and then application letter will also be given in the plain you know with your contact details com mobile email id and college will have to provide the marks card grade card cards of all the previous sub e semesters with subjects wise credit earned right so maximum marks minimum marks for passing and all those has to be filled by the college themselves for that particular students and to be attested attested by the college principal and all the you know schemes and syllabus and the soft copies etc and school college leaving certificate all those seats things needs to be there which you will get details more from your college and the scanned copies of all your details need to be sent to a vtu person you can see the mail uh, id there as balla bhavi right at vtu.ac.in and similarly to superintendent under vtu then only your process will kick in and for the students who are moving from other universities right like which i explained private universities or the government universities any university to any vtu autonomous college right so then also the similar process will be applicable for those students and scanned copy and migration certificate from the respective uh, colleges are also required apart from your regular mark card marks card or a previous semester and you need to maintain a you know good grades like you know 9 or 9.5 cgpa so that you will be considered then only for the uh, you know merit right for because lot of students will want to change their call branch as well as the college right in their own city or they can look for the other cities like top notch cities where good colleges like bangalore mysore and mangalore etc are there right so in all situations you will have to maintain good grades as well as without any fail and um, all migration certificate documents needs to be submitted by you to the college and vtu and then only your process will be uh, processed right that's all i have to cover and i hope you understood the fee structure and uh, you will get more details from your college thanks for watching and please do subscribe to get similar important updates throughout your career thank you bye